Of course, I'm a Ghanaian mother of four living in abroad. And taking care of kids here is not easy. Even taking care of kids as a whole is a full stress job. Of course, I'm a Ghanaian mother of four. And with four kids, every minute you have to separate fights. Ha! Huh? It's not easy. Like this child will be fighting this child. This one will be fighting this one. So every minute, every second, you have to separate fight. A Ghanaian mother of four. Of course, I can't sleep in the house in peace. Like the noise here, shouting, screaming. Oh my God. As a mother of four, what do you expect? You want to be sleeping 24 seven in your own house. It will not work because you have children around, children who always scream, who always shout. Yeah, that is mother of four duty. Never sleep in peace. I'm a Ghanaian mother of four living in abroad. Of course, anytime you go to shopping mall to shop for yourself, you'll be hearing you have a daughter, you have a son, you have four kids in your mind. Shop for them. Shop for them. You can't even shop for yourself because your mind will be speaking to you. Your child needs shoe. Your child needs singlet. Your child needs this. Blah, blah, blah. So as for us, mother of four in abroad, anytime we step into a shopping mall, it's always about a kiss. Yeah, of course. What do you expect? A mother of four, everything you do is for the kiss. Of course. I'm a Ghanaian mother of four living in abroad. We are always waking up early in the morning because your kids will be going to school. So if they will be going to school around nine, you have to wake up around 5 a.m. because you have four kids to make sure all of these kids are properly well-fed, well-dressed, well-organized before you take them to school. Yes, of course. What do you expect? If you have one child, at least you can sleep for a while. But if you have double, like four kids, then you have to wake up early to take care of them before you leave the house. Yeah, of course. What do you expect? As a mother of four. Of course, I'm a Ghanaian mother of four. Ha! I can't pull in peace. I can't bath in peace. I can't cook in peace. Anytime I'm around these places, my kids will be knocking. My kids will be coming. Mom, I want water. Mom, I want this. Mom, I'm hungry. Whilst they know I'm in the kitchen. Mom, I want water. Whilst they know I'm in the bathroom. Mom, what are you doing? Whilst they know I'm in the bathroom. Pooing! You can relate, right? Yeah! I'm a Ghanaian mom of four. You can't cook in small quantity because you have large family. You have four kids. Yeah. So every food that you cook has to be large quantity, has to be a lot so that at least when they eat, they will eat the leftover in the morning. I'm a Ghanaian mom of four. Of course, I live in abroad and every child here in abroad want different food every day. If you have to cook rice today, one more come, mom, today I will not eat rice. I want pizza. The other one will come, mom, I don't want pizza. I want burger. The other one will come, mom, why are you cooking fufu all the time? I don't want fufu. I want something new. Okay. That is the realest reality of a mom of four. Because every child wants different things. I'm a Ghanaian mom of four. Of course, I live in abroad. And in abroad, when you give birth or when you have kids, if you don't have family here, the stress is a lot. Because here we have no family. Like in Africa, when you give birth, you have your mother around, you have your friends around, you have your uh, in-laws around, you have your bestie around, you have everybody around to support. But here, as a mom of four, You'll be taking kids from school. You'll be taking them to school. Hospital appointment. The stress only go tire you. Mm -hmm. Because there is no support from anywhere. Only you. Only you. Hey. Yeah. Of course. 
What do you expect? I'm a Ghana mom of four. Everywhere you are going, you have to take your kids along. Shopping, they'll be along. Wherever you go, they have to follow. Because there is no other person in the house to take care of them. So your kids are like your school bag. Your kids are like your certificates. <laughs> yeah. My Ghana mom of four, living in abroad, of course, groceries, shopping, cost. Because you have four kids. Everything that you buy for A, you have to buy for B. So we don't normally save that much. You can't even save O. Because all these kids are money. And it's expensive. As a mom of four. So, hmm. If you are a mom of four and you are saving 50 euro a month, 100 euro a month, 300 euro a month, I salute you. Of course, that is the life of a mom of four.